Yo, I clutch my shaky finger, flow bringer, hell's bells ringer, from outside to inner, walk with the Mr. Many Beats for dinner. Welcome guys to a new video, thank you very much for joining me. Today we're going to be looking at the Nike Air Max 90 Bubble Pack. These released in 2020 and they're absolutely beautiful. Orinoco, loco from beginner, dub spinner, dirty beat antagonist, rap shit, I'm bagging this, slain the eye, ragged fist, masochist, see my name on the blackest list, baby roof past the bat, so I batter this, cold blood. I picked these up really randomly, looking through the GOAT app, as you do, and I seen them and I was like, yo, I've never seen these before. The textures on them are absolutely mental, the, the colours, the feel, the insole is super special. Guys. Let's just get into this review, man. If you are new to the channel, hit like, subscribe, turn notifications to make sure you don't miss any more of my videos. Without further ado, let's just get into this absolute banger. The sneakers come in a regular Nike box. The official description is Air Max 9020, Summit White Black Multicolor. You get a couple of extras in the box. There's a little writing on this pamphlet, but I can't read any of it, but just tells you how to put the shoe on. This thing is absolutely awesome. Look at this little bubble pack it comes in bubble hang tag i've never seen that before on any air max night that i own and i think that's pretty special so not only do you get a weird sneaker with loads of bubbles all over it you get a bubbly hang tag as well that's really cool starting with the tongue you get the nike air max label with loads of bubbles all over it that's a really nice touch on the sneaker but you don't feel that when you're walking so it's not hard the laces on the sneaker are soft cotton all along the upper, you get that beautiful bubbling effect on the toe box, the upper, and by the heel plate. I don't know about the like creamy to white contrast, like that's not my favorite color blocking, but it's a nice touch, that's for sure. You get synthetic leather for the multicolor layers, which looks really, really cool. It's just, look at it, it's wild. It doesn't change color at all, but it does reflect quite cool. You obviously, you've got a synthetic leather on your black swoosh as well. A nice Air Max sign there. The heel plate is like a cream colour as well, which is another nice touch. The midsole is made of foam and the outsole is made of rubber. That beautiful waffle design, just plain white, is really nice. Then the magic happens. Look at that insole. That is absolutely beautiful. Have you ever seen anything like it before? Woo! All those beautiful bubbles all over the inside. That is my favourite piece of this sneaker, apart from the bubbly effect. They went all out with these sneakers, and I just got them for a steal on the go up. On the bottom, it's just normal. But, yeah, look at that. Woo! Absolutely awesome. Overall materials on this sneaker, I'm giving them an 8 out of 10. We've been through the materials, now we're going to get down to the sizing, the comfortability, and my overall score. And overall materials on these sneakers are about an 8 out of 10. Because of that extra bubbly plastic they've got all over the top, it has an impact on the comfortability. But other than that, they're a pretty comfortable shoe. They feel really nice on feet, and they are actually pretty decent for walking around in. But eventually, those harder materials will get on you, just to pre-warn you if you ever think about buying these. They came out in 2020, so obviously there's a bit more yellowing than what you would expect normally. But that rainbow pattern looks wise they just are they look really cool man i love the textured effects all around the sneaker the bubbly it reminds you of like bubble wrap sort of like you know you just sit there popping it after you've opened a package that's like one of my favorite things that's one of my favorite things to do when i open a package if there is some i'll sit there with my kids just popping all the stuff because of the beautiful soft sock liner the comfortability is still there so they've done a really good job of that so when it comes down to sizing you'll be good going true to size Walking around, general day-to-day, -day, they're pretty comfortable. But for me, this is a collector's piece. There's a lot of padding on the sneaker, but it's really soft. So you've got a little bit of play on each side of the sneaker and around the toe box. So overall, I would say go true to size. Now, guys, it's time to rate the sneaker. If you're looking at a comfortability, a sneaker for comfortability, these wouldn't be a 10 out of 10. Creativity, they'd be a 10 out of 10. Looks-wise, they'd be a 10 out of 10. But overall an overall score for the sneaker i can only give it a 9 out of 10 i can't give it that 10 mark it just misses that mark on the comfortability a little bit but for looks quality innovation just like what wackiness well i think they're really cool my overall score for these air max noi bubble pack is a 9 out of 10 guys let me know what you think down in the comments what's your overall score for these sneakers the yellowing might put some people off but yeah overall man i think they're really cool a really, really wild Air Max 90 for Air Max month. And I got one more on the way. 
Now, I've not shared what I've got just because I want to surprise you guys with a review. Let me know if you want to know any more information about these sneakers. I'll be happy to answer your questions. I'll leave links down below in the description for anything you would like to know and purchase links. But guys, I am done with this review. Thanks so much for watching. Happy Air Max Month again. Got another review on the way. Keep checking out my daily Nike Air Max 90 videos. Thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe for more. And I will see you in the next video. Salute! All the plug on their fake rap shenanigans. Heavyweight team, we're packing more beef than Brannigan's. E flow, all tight to all my people. I spit my shit while I think about the sequel. The next stepper, grind the track like Pepper. You know the name, you know the name, you know the name, cause we're painting it about. You know the name, cause we're painting it about. You know the name, you, you know the name, you, you know the name, cause we're painting it about. You know the name, cause we're painting it about. Go paint the town, then retreat to my mecca. This whole industry's caught disease like leper. I speak from the heart to the very last letter. Trendsetter, fuck your pretty boy fashion. This the Mr. Men, mighty marvelous ear bashing. Mics clashing, beer bottles smashing. My shotters at the back break hard to get the cash in. Monty dropping bombs to make the sky come crashing.